good minds, y'all. How is all thems and all those? Hope everybody is well in the land of the living. You know the usual. It's the Robert. Nobody important. I got a rough one for y'all. Yep, yep, yep. And here it comes. I get off work yesterday. I get a phone call while I was at work. Boom, 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 whatever, whatever. That's irrelevant. Get a phone call. Lady needs old refrigerator removed from her home, taken away, and removed a new refrigerator brought into her dwelling. Sure, Robert can handle that. I'll give you a call half hour before I get off of work, ma'am. Thank you for calling me. By the way, how did you get my number, blah, blah? Thank you for all of those. Okay, I will be there. I get off of work. I get there. Me and my homeboy, I ain't going to say his name or whatever, but me and my co-worker get there. I see the old refrigerator on the porch. Okay. And then a new refrigerator is off. Oh, I forgot to say. She's a non-me. She's a non-me. And she has a pickup. And she's by herself. So the truck, the, 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 the refrigerator is off the truck. I was like, oh no. I guarantee her she did all that by herself. Lo and behold, how did I know that? We pull up, blah, blah, blah. I introduce you, say, hey, how you doing? I'm the Robert, blah, 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 or whatever. Right off the gip. I said, man, what would you need? What do you need done? Whatever. This needs to go on my truck, blah, 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 whatever, whatever. From the gate, she set it off. She just straight up, she thought she bought or owned a Robert and Company. Y'all, anybody who knows me will be very proud of me. I held my composure. Okay, blah, blah, blah. All right, this is what needs to be done. Blah, blah, blah. Excuse me, can we get started? She's getting in the way every half a second to where we can't do Nathan. And I mean Nathan. To where things ain't going right. And now she's starting to cuss a match at me. Not to, not towards me or, you know, with me. It's at me. She's straight cussing me out because she's speeding, trying to do a million things. When I asked, I said, ma'am, if you would just move out the way, we can get this done. She wasn't hearing it. All she keeps talking about is she built log cabins on her own and... Her father, whatever, this and all that. I, God bless the dead. She just buried her father. God bless that man. You can tell she's farm raised. And her name starts with K. It ain't Karen, but it, it's very close. But she wasn't Karen before the day was out. A remix Karen. So as this thing is, is uh, attempting to transpire, she made this whole act a thousand times worse than than it had to be. Take the dolls off. Spin it that way. Tell it what I, It got to the point where this lady was cussing me out because she was having fun. And then where I got to a point where it's, look here, ma'am, you don't have to keep talking to me like this this way. I don't, I'm not cussing at you. Well, this is how I am. And I, what, what I, I, oh, really? But ladies and gentlemen, people who know me, true fans only, I held my composure for just a lee little bit more. My partner, by the way, he just right there, he's staying in his lane. He's trying to assist her the whole time because I, I, I got out the way because she kept getting in the way and she was arguing with me about every little thing that I was doing to get that refrigerator into that dwelling. Oh, and by the way, the old refrigerator had to come out. We already got that over to the truck. So just remember that part. So anyways, why her and my partner for 16 minutes are sitting there wrestling with that refrigerator when I told them it's not going to go that way. She says, take the doors off. I said, if you take the doors off, we're trying to avoid taking the doors off because if you put them, take them off, they're not going to line back up correctly as always. Blah, 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 whatever, whatever, whatever. It gets to the point where we get it halfway in the door, it comes back, gotta come back out. Now she gotta take the door. She started taking the door off, and I told you, whatever, whatever, she said, well, put the door back on. So I started to put that one screw back in for her, it wouldn't go in. And I stated to her, 
I said, man, this is a prime example where I told you, try to avoid taking the doors off at all costs. You never said that to me. The minute I said to her, ma'am, yes, I did. I got it all on film. For only, and I mean, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> only three minutes, she changed up her whole attitude once she realized this was a camera and not just a, a Negro prop. Yeah, her whole demeanor changed up for only for three minutes, though. Once she tried to put that, that screw back into that door, man, she went ballistic on the robber. She went ballistic. Ladies and gentlemen, I don't know what else to do. I don't know how I got through that one. Yes, I do. I got, I squeezed through that doorway. I got in my car and I yelled to my partner, my partner, hey, yo, is she going to give you a ride? Because I'm out. I'm being so severely apologetic to this woman the whole time for her cussing me out while she's cussing me out. And she's steady cussing me out more. There were so many things to where I wanted to say to her, I'd have made that lady commit suicide because my mouth gets real nice nasty. But I held my composure. That was one of the roughest moving jobs I have ever in my 20 something years of dealing with the public and dealing with household goods I ever had to encounter. And I dealt with some rough ones. And the, mark, the end of the story is, I never got paid for nothing. Even in the middle of it, while she was cussing me out, belittling me, giving me the F-bomb like she was Georgina Gordon Ramsey's wife or something, Ramsey, whatever his name is, she was saying, she was saying the F-bomb towards me more than I ever heard in my life. And do I got to remind you, she was non-this. I don't know what... That Karen Jean, that you Karens carry, but they need to come up for a cure of that. The hell with Corona, you need to come up with a cure for Karen. Because that lady, man, she ran a mule off when all that field, that, that field needed plowing. But I take my hat off to myself and pat myself on both shoulders because I held my composure. And like I said for the third time, true fans only, those who know me, God, I got a mouth from hell on me that'll just make anybody, it'll make a, a, a sorry bastard look for God. And beginning of that, like and subscribe, send notifications, don't cost you nothing. With that being said, y'all need to be, y'all need to be proud of me. And I'm going to tell you one thing. I'm going to tell you one thing that went wrong with this whole scenario. Are you ready for it? I'm going to tell you the number one thing that went wrong with this whole scenario of me getting cussed out for at least a half hour by a non Karen and put up with it because we was deep in way Waterford, Connecticut, and I didn't stand a chance because I'm this. But yeah. The number one thing that we did wrong, not just me, me and my partner, you know what we did wrong? We showed up to do work. Hot sauce, bong bong. Yeah, <laughs> you better talk to him. Peace.